The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the undisputed WWE Championship. Ladies and gentlemen, the people's champion is here. I can barely hear you, Saxton. The WWE Universe has come unglued. Oh, you know why, Corey? It's all due to the power of the Brahma Bull. And guys, unsurprisingly so, social media right now is buzzing. Well, because he represents millions and millions, literally. More than 415 million followers on social media. They smell it all right. Indeed, the great one. The Apex Predator has arrived. Introducing the challenger from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the Rock! And his opponent from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds, the undisputed WWE Champion, the Viper, Randy. A fully confident challenger in their corner, absolutely hell-bent on capturing the title. here in my opinion this championship could main event any show any place any time full declaration byron but given the competitors vying for the title tonight i'd be inclined to agree he turns it around scooped up what are we looking for here launches was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one was only thinking about dominance it's easier said than done, but when you're in the ring with The Rock, the best thing you can do is try to shake his confidence. Pester him. These two going strike for strike, it seems. Now the competitor is backing down. The fight is on, and it's furious. Looks like a hockey fight's just broken out. Oh, WWE Universe appreciating these athletes going all out. Catches the cover by the champ. Kick out before the one count. Still in it. gets countered there. Close line! The Viper able to strike back. The 
Press, press. Raining down right hands. The champ isn't backing off, bringing the lightning and thunder with every single strike. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Getting set up for something in the corner. Big clothesline. And he just showed Orton no fear with an assault like that. The Rock brought that Anawaii toughness to bear, and his opponent didn't have an answer. Oh, and a reversal. Here we go. With an exploder suplex. Incredible, absolutely incredible. Ripped in the hard way. Up fast, by Buster. Down hard. The great one looking razor. Get ready, Corey. Get ready for the most electrifying move. Chip's eyes look glazed over. For the win! Two! Ah, oh, the champ avoids a three count. Guys, I thought we were getting a new champion there. Uh, well, we might see a new champ here tonight. Don't put the cart before the horse. The champ kicked out and has no intentions on losing that title anytime soon. That usually finishes most men. The Rock has to be frustrated not getting the fall. Yeah. Boom. Ooh, strong Irish whip. He's positioning himself, closing in. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. Stopped in their tracks with a knee to the gut. Time to go for... Suplex. The challenger is not in a great place. That is the sort of bloodthirsty offense that Randy Orton does so well. Pulls their opponent in. Belly to. scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Attempted close cover for the championship! And Orton just barely manages to escape a pinfall. He just kicked out by a fraction of a second. The Rock caught off guard here. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. Kick out the whole flip on. The champion's shot is palpable. The champ will have to dig deeper now. That should have been it. Nine This war. 
Tossed back into the ring. The Apex Predator is showing no concern for his opponent. Randy Orton positioning his opponent. Orton is set. And just got caught with that DDT. Orton's planning and calculations paying off there. Just as he planned it. Orton firing up. The voices are talking to him. Perfect time to attack when his guard is down. Oh, close line. The Rock sent him on the rock bottom. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm has shifted. Oh, kicks out, kicks out. I can't believe it. We were a second away from a new champion. Are we close to the start of a new reign? And guys, The Rock is not happy with that result. Thought it was over, but the kick surprised him there's electricity running through this arena right now will it be the spark for one of these competitors sizing up their opponent and front knee drop boom oh counters right into the bread basket Vicious reversal with an elbow right to the mush. Ooh, focused attack on the neck. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. The Viper with meticulous agonizing stomps over and over again. Desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. Getting him into the corner. And it's a long way down from there. Oh my goodness, from the top rope. Devious thoughts percolating to the mind of the The champ will stay champ. Cover! Randy Orton is overjoyed to remain champion. That match deserves another look. Here we go. Here is your winner, and still undisputed WWE Champion, The Viper, Randy Orton. A successful title defense for him tonight. He just cemented his title reign with a gutsy performance. Time to party with the Prophets.
Johnny Gargano, Tommaso Ciampa. This is DIY. I've been fortunate enough to call many of the wars these two men have fought side by side and against each other. They are a fun team to watch. Two men who have been the heart and soul of NXT. They brought that same passion to the main roster and have quickly become a top team in the WWE. And we're about to see that passion on display. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 492 pounds, Angelo Douglas and Montez Ford, the Street Profits. And their opponents at a combined weight of 400 the WWE Tag Team Champions, Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa D.I.Y. Here we go, gentlemen. The tag team titles are up for grabs. Final preparations between partners before the action begins. Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa, collectively known as DIY, ready for action. That acronym is what fuels Ciampa and Gargano. They were never expected to even make it to WWE, but... Tossed outside. With more in mind. Oh, DDT! Took a massive risk, but it might have paid off. Some showboating from Johnny Gargano here. And back to the mat. Oh man! Slingshot DDT off the apron. Boom! Tilt a world face buster. And shoulders are down. Two breaks the count at two. And frustration might be starting to set in. He knows how to avoid contact. Oh, must be tackle. Just discarded the champ like a chump. in the corner. Who gets squished with that? Those two are in such a cohesive rhythm out there. It's like playing jazz, but using your opponent as the drum. And Gargano saw that coming. Wow, belly to belly. Ooh, clothesline deliver. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Look out! Suicide dive! Pinpoint precision, right on target. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. Missed timing with that springboard. Clothesline to the back of the neck. Able to get out of the way. Spine buster. 99. Really just laying it in. The champ getting put to the test here. Yeah, as the Street Profits' particular brand of intensity was showing through there. Tornado DDT! Here's a pin for the title. Just kicks out. Close call. That was almost lights out. Oh, ouch. He skirts around it. Attack right in the sternum. Placed in the corner now. Gut buster. Good no. How can 
the challengers put up a fight in this situation. This is truly disheartening to watch. These are such talented superstars and forge. Lift off. DDT with diving delivery. Amazing. Cover. There's two. And they kick out at two. He got close there. It could be do or die time. Ooh, man. Here comes the throwback. And Ford had it scouted. Sky high. High impact missile drop kick. Guys, I can't think of the worst place for him to be right now. Uh, any guesses of what we're about to see here? A tornado bomb! Poised in the corner across the rank. Butterfly double underhook up and fairy tale ending. But champions need to finish the job. Two kick out still has hope. Just barely able to kick out. I thought the champ had it in the bag. This is how much the championship needs. You can see the sweat drip out of the challengers every pour. I can see it on his face. Champa is ready to reload and get back on the attack after that kick out. Turnbuckle now. Uh oh, up top. Uh oh, it's wrong. Wow, what impact! This has been an absolutely brutal display of will from these men. You can see their flames starting to flicker. And it's only a matter of time before one goes out. Here's the pin title. Moment. Both competitors digging into wells they didn't even know existed. Slice bread. Oh, countered into a power slam. Placed into the corner. Tag is made. Tremendous combination put together there. Boom! Lights out. DDT connects. Cover! Two! No, I thought he had it. You gotta be kidding me. Holy moly, how? Attack gets reversed. Gargano strike hits the mark. Dropping the elbow. Tag. Oh, I think the champ's got it. Makes a cover. Maybe not. Oh, a slingshot cross body onto the outside. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. <laughs> Thrown back in under the ropes. Pow, what a shot. Oof. Dawkins avoids that one. Close fist connects. And it's Champa having to endure some bad intentions there. And that is Dawkins' intensity starting to ratchet up. And Dawkins channeling his energy here. <laughs> Hits him with the counter. Trying to put this thing away. Shoulders down, rolled up. No, stops the count at two. 
you got a question. How much is it worth? How much is it worth to continue through the agony? It's obviously worth everything. Obviously worth every drop of sweat on the ground. Great strength being shown here. Whoa, not quite yet. Jump it. He made it. Tag made. Oh, back of the elbow. Big splash. Some hard offense landing on the champ. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Listen to this place. Champa kick to the abdomen. Champa with a psycho cutter. He keeps his team in the match. That turns it around for Montez. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Looking a little out of it, up on that turn. This game's about winning at any and all costs. This competitor knows exactly what they want to do. Perched on the top rope, and it is Superplex! Tag is made, and here we go. Vicious right forearm. Shot to the gut will break things up. Whoa, look out! Trying to do as much damage as humanly possible. But at what cost? Whoa, Whoa just floating through the air. Oh! Oh my god! DDT! Talk about devastation. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. Perched up top. Fails to hit the bullseye. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Deep, deep trouble here for Montez. Got out of that situation and avoids any harm. Oh, point of the elbow finds the mark. And listen to this place. It's deafening in here, Michael. Looking wobbly in the corner. There's the tag. These two superstars planning a double team maneuver. We can have a new champion. For the win. Two. They got it. And they're the new tag team champions. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. That's about as perfect an example of tag team wrestling you're ever likely to see.
The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Damian Priest, representing The Judgment Day. From Bray, County Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn Balor. This is the kind of match the WWE Universe has been dreaming of, and that dream is about to become a reality. A competitor who always has his game face on, ready for a major battle. Jey Uso is here, and he is a new man. And his opponent, from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, one half of the WWE World Tag Team Champions, The one thing that hasn't changed about Jey Uso is his unrelenting desire to be at the top of WWE. Yeah, and at this point, I don't think anything can hold him back. Jey Uso has truly reached main event status. Well, this man is taking aim at the Prince. Guys, he better not miss. Yeah, it takes a lot of guts to step up to a competitor like Finn Balor. But a win could change his career. With Jey Uso, you have to remember, we're looking at a tag team specialist who's really made a name for himself as a singles competitor as of late. Defying his family's wishes, carving out a path for himself as just Jay. He has truly been a delight to watch grow as a competitor these days. But Finn Balor's become obsessed with accumulating power and wreaking havoc on anyone who stands in the way of his goals. Balor's always been a certified threat, but now he's off the leash. So if you want to put yourself in a very dangerous position, then get in Balor's way and see what happens. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Up high. Whoa, what a landing. And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. You know, if Balor knows what's good for him, he'll move away from that high-risk style tonight and play a little smart. High-risk style can also reap high reward, though, Corey. That's what Balor's banking on here. And you've got to admit, it's worked well for him thus far in his career. Two of these. You're going to need your back adjusted after that one. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Sex. You might get caught. Slight blade. Follow it up with a... And a basement drop kick. Finn Balor channeling the activity of the Balor Club here. And pure cheapness we just saw with that attack. Targeted the lower body there, and it was highly effective. Kick gets caught. Uh -oh. These two showing how well scouted they each are. And set right into the corner. Oh, what an enziguri right in the ear. He's able to sidestep there. What started out a few short weeks ago with a few choice words has turned into an all-out blood feud between them. This is a level of aggression that few take it to, but when they do, it's all-out war. Oh, jeez. Nasty kick to the face. Off into the pin. Two. Barely gets the 
kick out. He's looking to do whatever it takes to survive. Look ringside now, guys. This manager's doing something very suspicious. Ooh! Going down low, nasty uppercut. The official making clear this is, in fact, not that kind of match. Get more than a one count at this point. An agile escape. Oh, Finn Balor with the overhead kick. From the top. A quick reversal by Jay. Tagging this outside. Look at this. The dive. A roll of the dice. Look at this. Oh, God. Throwing all caution to the wind and leaping to the outside. Dragon screw. from the floor now. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Rapid fire. So and he goes for the pin. And that'll be a rope break right there. Jay with bad intentions. Uh-oh. Switches it back around. Balor hoisted him up. Ooh, 1916. Finn got all of it. Three, no, a two count. What a crucial kick out, and the blood is still pumping for Jey Uso. This means Finn has to adjust. Finn needs to reconstruct his game plan. Bam! Finn's chances are fading. Truly extraordinary kick out by Finn Balor. And Jay threw everything he had at his opponent. You gotta wonder what else he's gotta do to put him away. These men have been all gas and no breaks tonight. And they have to be feeling the effects. Well, they have to be running on fumes. I don't know how much longer they can go. Super kick! I think Jay's making a great... Guys feel no love for each other. Here's another look. Here is your winner. Main event. Jay Uso. Finn Balor just falling short tonight, suffering quite the loss. We know Finn Balor has the skills, all the tools, all the talent, but tonight was simply not the Prince's night. The following contest is a no holds barred match. That is for 
the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Here he comes, the best in the world. And he's not here to make friends. He's here to make money. And CM Punk made his return with a flood of emotions, but he knows he now has unfinished business and a story of his own to complete. After nearly a decade away from WWE, Punk can still compete at a high level, and he'll need that with today's competitors. A polarizing figure, but Punk is determined to be the best. Punk's return was an amazing moment, but now he must capitalize. Yeah, easier said than done because the competition is now at an all-time high. Is being the best in the world still good enough? A true blue chip talent, Braun Breaker. A powerhouse second generation superstar. Introducing the challenger from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, C.M. Punk! And his opponent from Woodstock, Georgia, weighing in at 230 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Braun. The Intercontinental Championship, one of the most prestigious. The WWE Intercontinental Title. <laughs> Online, perhaps a new chapter will be written in this championship's long history. For over 40 years, the WWE's best have competed for this title. Winning the Intercontinental Title has been a major milestone stone in some Hall of Fame careers and well, it could be just that again here tonight. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Dealing out some damage and looking good doing it. Byron, a match like this is when we see how merciless someone can be. What will this come down to? This is about who can weather the storm. A superstar can attack at will here. Everything is a weapon. That is what makes this so dangerous. It's anything goes. There are no limits here. And it can be chilling to see the lights. Someone's willing to go to to destroy another human being. And by chilling, I mean beautiful. Adrenaline can make you do crazy things. Exhibit A right there. Braun fires back. 
He's looking for something. This could get dangerous. And as a couple of Hall of Famers once said, it's time to get the tables. situation when superstars with a rivalry like this one get in the ring. It's basically just a recipe for disaster. They'll hold nothing back in their pursuit of victory. This is a deeply personal beef and they're trying to settle it the only way they know how. He's thinking the steel chair is just what he needs to wreak some havoc here. Oh man, he grabbed the kendo stick. Everyone needs to watch out now. Oh, what a close line. Watch this. Beautiful Northern Lights suplex. The beginning of the end. Kick out from the challenger. That's way too close. Boom. Wow. Dodge is just in time. Oh, what a right. Man, that's some attitude behind it. The challenger eating up some damage. Placing his opponent on the top turnbuckle. And a stiff right hand. What happens next will not end well. Please don't do this! Superplex to the floor! Breakers. Showing just how intense he can be. Never letting up. Never letting down. Awesome. Whip back into the ring. Set up for spear. Another one bites the dust to the champ. Two hangs on by a thread. That's how much winning this title means to give everything you've got. I don't know how much you can have left after that, but you've got to be impressed. And Breaker has to be wondering just what it's going to take to end this. How far does he have to go? He knew that was coming. You're a Nagi, my fuck! He turns it! Wasting no time! Anaconda Vice is cinched in! Uh, he's in complete control! Opponent has nowhere to go! Could be tapped! Uh, a couple of knees! right into the corner, leaving himself open here. This is not going to be for the faint of heart. Climbing up to the top rope and... Now we're following Moonsault Slam. Is it enough? The cover! Two count. No, championship match continues. Every kick out taking so much energy to muster. Oh. Evades their offense. Spinning kick to the gut. These combatants have stretched their limits here, and it's showing. Win or lose, they are going home tonight knowing they gave it their all. Two! Emphatic kick out from the champion. He just won't give up. Breaker sidesteps out of that. Into the side slam. Nice. He's going for it all. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. Soaring. Oh, no. Well, it's not going to be pretty. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. Going to see a new oh. champ. And he's still in the game. That was a matter of a fraction of a second. CM Punk thought that was enough. We thought that was enough, but somehow it didn't earn the three count. Arm ringer. Punch in the face. back on the champion. Can the champion respond with their back against the wall? We're about to learn a lot about this kid, Braun Breaker, guys. How will he respond to such a close near fall? He's taking this to the floor now. There are no words for the line these fans have gone through in this match. It has been a roller coaster, and I don't think the ups and downs are over. 
yet. This whole building is shaking. Matches like this are what it's all about. He puts him on the table. We know this will not end well. Bad position for Puck. Buster through the table. Unbelievable impact. Shattering the table and shattering the opposition. What a clothesline. Ouch. Momentum is running away from Puck. CM Punk needs to bring the match back to his pace. Shock Cole, we all thought that was it. 
The end for Breaker is looking inevitable here. Punk has him trapped up across the shoulders. GTS connects. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm has shifted. Oh, this should be it. Punk with his opponent up. Good night, GTS. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Shoulder up, still holding on to the title. This is complete insanity. Still holding on to the title by the skin of their teeth. Slingshot. Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. thrown back into the ring. Trapping the arms. Oh, what blows to the back of the neck. CM Punk is in a distressing spot. Punk needs to be resourceful. Find a moment to strike. Braun Breaker, his strength on display. This is absolutely incredible. Power slam. Time to look at some of the highlights from that last matchup. title.